Here's a blanket I've been working on <laughs> uh, for my daughter for her birthday. Well, I promised this to her for her graduation to high school, but uh, <laughs> that was a few years ago. She'll be 23. I dug it out and I finished crocheting it and now I added, you know, the owl. Uh, their school mascot is owls, but I re redesigned it because it's normally an owl in flight. But I sat it down, put a drum between the twin legs, drumsticks, I had the hat, and I brought the wings up instead of out, like flight. Um, and the reason, my, the, drum, the reason for the drum is because she was a drummer in high school. And I had to put the hat on there because we live in Oklahoma, and why not? So, uh, yeah, this is my intro, and I'm just going to try to finish this up in silence so y'all can just watch along. I get other colors. Excuse my snuffling, I'm sorry. Uh, I don't know what color to be. She probably should be black. almost done. I just, it just doesn't look done. I don't know what it's missing. The permanent markers that I use, uh, stay in. And it takes a beating. I've got one that I made over 10 years ago that I washed, oh my gosh, a thousand times. And it's just now starting to fade. Um, about all I gotta do is just ret retouch it up. It's not that hard. But the trick is to really get this. I hope you can see what I'm doing. Probably not. Um, is to really dab. Get this color really into that yarn really good. That's looking better. I started this years ago. And I thought I'd finish it now for her. And let y'all see how I do them. If my hand's in the way you can't see what I'm doing, I'm so sorry. But you can't believe how hard this is to do this and get it in the <laughs> camera. But yeah, you just gotta keep going over it and really dab. You could just Yarn really saturated with the ink. I've tried all kinds of different markers and pens and stuff. You know, markers that's actually for fabric, expensive ones, and they, I just don't like them. I think this stands up to washing a lot better. When it does start fading, just no big deal. It's a lot easier to just go over it than actually doing this, doing this whole thing at the beginning. Um, I just. I know how to do the grid. I know how to design it and, you know, and change, color change. And I could do this by crocheting a colored yarn into it, but why? I mean, this is much easier.
Yes, I should have some music on, so I have to sit here and keep talking and just yeah, yabbering away, stuttering. Okay, I'll finish the owl up off the camera, uh, but yeah, I gotta figure out what I want the big. How I want that? I'm not sure yet. It looks like you know it's not finished colored in, but and I want the owl to be red. These are just you know shadows from how the how it's sitting. Uh, yeah. Okay, I'll, I'll be back.